the very lovely pictures of the Jima University at the Jima University Stadium comes into focus again this afternoon. Bayer Dar uh, take it on uh, a very seasoned St. George side, a team that has never been relegated in the Premier League. That's what they were looking for. Adunya goes for the shot. Uh, good technique in uh, controlling on the first one and then going for the hard shot. There's Fitzuma Lemu and there's Fikre Mikaela Lemu. They've picked it at the edge of the box. Can they work fast enough? Well, the intention was there for a shot. It showed very, very early. Should have taken his time to build it again, but I think they're in a hurry to try and get that goal. And uh, Saleh Ablak's uh, taken shot tells you he's caught from uh, a, a distance before, but on his left foot, maybe not as powerful. Something the defender was found napping here, Gil, but the shot is not a good one. <laughs> but there's a captain uh, just next there waiting for it, Gitani Kebede. Totally incensed by the fact that uh, the ball doesn't come to him from uh, Robin Neglande. Or the attack that will come with it. Emmanuel Gabriel Michael. Ooh, is the one who's going to take it here. The defense missing it, and too much energy coming from uh, the youngster. Sends the ball too far out. Talking about Emmanuel Terfu. Should relax a bit here. That's a good cross there. Yeah, it and was a dummy, and then yeah. the miss there would have been very crucial. And that's Terfu. But he brought in such a hard cross, he could have even just turned round. Oh. to the left try to get that right hand corner there my hair davids likes it i think the only thing he doesn't like is the fact that they haven't scored a goal at this moment but uh it's gonna be a free kick a big one into the box uh, enough men missing it enough yellow stockings including fring pong men still going for it Getani Kebede was there as well. I'm very worried. Sion Merid at this moment. He didn't know who it was going to come from, but he had taken some good position there. The Ghanaian doesn't waste time to try and switch the play onto the right side. Finds Emmanuel Gabriel Mikael. The cross is picked up by the goalkeeper Sione. Oh, uh, yeah. Clutching onto it like everything depends on it. Because if that ball slips past him, it was a good, very nicely weighted cross. Uh, the left foot in swinger is what uh, it is being expected. All the tallest of men's are, men are in there. They're coming from behind, cleared on the line. Uh, there's going to be a foul here, but this is one of those ones that Fringpong will wonder what he needed to do more than the power he put in the header. From the in swinger, puts on power. And uh, it was just cut out on the line. This is a shot that comes off uh, the middle there from uh, a very hard shot uh, coming from Nat Nile, another one of the Football Trading Center Pilot Association. And uh, he just capitalized on what was going to be a loose ball there while everybody else is waiting for the referee to say there's going to be a foul here. And two defenders leaving the ball. Minilu Wondimu. Oh, he's going to get a penalty. And uh, he's putting it outside of the line. And uh, he's going to give a yellow card here as well. I think uh, we'll see. Pointed. We'll see what he says. No, at first he was pointing just outside. We'll see. We'll see what he has said. Uh, referee being accosted by a good number of players, including the Bahadur players, and I'm thinking he said it's a free kick, Gilbert, because he didn't point down, unless we didn't see it correctly. He Someone's going to get yellow carded. The decision made for a penalty, and Wondimu, I think, is the man who takes the responsibility as well. Oh, Wondimu blasts the ball over. The technique's not so well done. From the Jima University Stadium, Bayer Darnell, St. George Neil, it's full time of a very entertaining afternoon here in Jima.